What's up, guys? Back for another video. I'm Ryan. It's George. It's Papa Guys. How you living? Lost in Vegas coming back at you with another unbiased real reaction. Real yeah. reaction. Free thinkers, baby. Free thinking gang out here. You shout know. Out, shout out to all the free thinkers. I'm all telling the free you, thinkers man. out there, man. Appreciate y'all. Love y'all. So cool. Today, what we got, man? What we got? Today, we got Immortal Technique Dance with the Devil. Finally. <laughs> now, this is George's shit. You know, George knows this song. I don't know this song. Ryan's never heard this song. So. Ryan's never heard this. <laughs> he's, he's in for a treat. So, uh, yeah, classic hip hop joint. You know, some people call it a masterpiece. I think it's a great song. Uh, Mortal Technique is, is kind of been underground his entire career, man. Actually, he's a dope rapper okay. from New York. Um, I'm anxious to see Ryan's take on it. <laughs> this is the type of song that you need to, that's, that's good if you haven't heard it before. You know what I mean? You can't just do kind of what we do sometimes with. You know, reacting to songs that we've we've heard. Word, yep. mm -hmm. This is like a real like you need to not have heard this song before to really get the best out of it. So, dance with the devil, immortal technique. Let's get right into it. Let's do it. Immortal technique. Okay. I once knew a nigga okay. whose real name was William. His primary concern was making a million, being the illest hustler. What you think of the beat? The beat is fire. You like that? I, I like that beat. That, ooh, ah, ooh, mm, ah, ooh. Sometimes I'm like a little iffy because I know Ryan, Ryan, yeah. Ryan likes dynamic production. So sometimes I'm like, I don't know if he's going to like this, this, this stripped down boom bap type of beat. But this is the thing. I like it. I like boom bap beats if it doesn't sound like it's made, made in a made dungeon. In the basement. Yeah, you know, you knew I was gonna say that. <laughs> like some of Wu Tang shit, he just he just. Oh my like. good, but I like Wu Tang though, so don't don't yeah. get it twisted. Some, of, like some of the production sounds it, it, it just it, it just is. sounds like you you know it's like it's just real grimy. Yeah, it's like damn, doesn't seem like it's been mastered, and that's why people the kind of reason why people love Wu Tang is that that gutter griminess of the. It's authentic. But just wanted to see if you liked the beat. Yeah. Let's get back to it. <laughs> Father and his mom was a fiend, she put the pipe down But for every year she was sober Her son's heart simultaneously grew colder wow. He started hanging out, selling bags in the projects Checking the young chicks, looking for hit and run prospects wow. He was fascinated by material objects But he understood, money never bought respect uh -huh. no right. Cause he could hustle and steal But got locked once and didn't hesitate to squeal so Uh oh <laughs> So William Yeah, he William. didn't hesitate to squeal, huh? Yeah, he was he was he was trying to you know trying to move his way up in the hood so to speak. He wanted right. he wants to have, had a respect from the hustlers in the game, mm -hmm. and apparently, you know, this guy's squealing now. You yeah. know what I mean? Got, get he you got killed. caught. He got jammed up one day. Now he's now he's squealing. That'll get you killed though. Yeah, man. If you if you involved in street shit, you know the you know the code, man. You're not supposed to snitch. Man. And you can't. You can't snitch. Yes, guys, guys, bring it back. <laughs> real though. To squeal, so criminals he chilled with Didn't think he was real You see, me and niggas like this have never been equal I don't project my insecurities on other people Wow Eating for props like addicts with pipes and needles And so he felt he had to prove to everyone he was evil A feeble-minded young man with infinite potential The product of a ghetto brain. Excellent line Yeah. A feeble-minded um, feeble young man with infinite uh, potential, potential. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Now, because he's people minded, he feels the need to prove himself, to prove that he's this evil yeah. guy, just because he wants to get respect from dudes in the hood. Capitalistic mental, mm. coincidentally, dropped out of school to sell weed, dancing with the devil, smoke until his eyes would bleed, but he was sick of selling trees and gave it to his greed. Dance with the devil. Yeah. <laughs> that's, when you, that's what happens when you rape, murder, and sell rock. You're yep. dancing with the devil. Yep, that's, that's the true. The the song. You know what I mean? Yep, that's hot. Dope. The chance, but then again, there's always the wicked that no one advance. Dance forever with the devil on a cold cell block. But that's what happens when you rape, murder, and sell rock. Devils used to be gods, angels that fell from the top. Mm. There's no diversity because we're burning in the melting pot. Mm. Wow. No diversity because we're burning in the melting pot. Yeah. Melt pot. That's hot. Billy started robbing niggas anything he could do to get his respect back in the eyes of his crew. So 
starting fights over little shit up on the block. Stepped up to selling mothers and brothers to crack pot. Wow. Working overtime for making money for the crack spot. Hit the jackpot and wanted to move up to cocaine. For the <laughs> scarface fantasy stuck in his brain. Mm. Tired of the block niggas treating him the same. Fulfilling the scarface fantasy stuck in his yep. brain. Beautiful. You know what I like about this man? Storytelling. Well, you're captivated. Yeah. Like you are in the story. Yeah. It almost feels like you're not even in the room. Right. You know? you're, you're just you're entranced with man. What what's being said? You know me. Dope. That's why this is such a classic, man. Let me let me bring it back just a little. Yeah, bit. my bad, guys. My bad. Nah, I paused it. <laughs> Stuck in his brain, tired of the block niggas treating him the same. He wanted to be major like the cutthroats and the thugs, but when he tried to step to him, niggas showed him no love. They told him he snitched. Yep. Cowboy can sell drugs. Mm -hmm. Any bitch nigga with a gun, yeah, can bust slugs. Yep. Yeah, uh huh. Yeah, any that. coward nigga can sell drugs. Any bitch nigga can bust slugs. Yep. You back a scared dude into a corner, a dude who's soft. Yep. And just out of fear, he can shoot you. It doesn't mean that he's some thug. Yeah, he's a thug. Yep, absolutely. You know. Any nigga with a red shirt can front like a blood. Yeah. Even puffy smoke the motherfucker up in the club. Dog <laughs> stab someone till they die. Standing in front of them, staring straight into their eyes. Mm. Really realized that these men were well guarded and they wanted to test them before business started. Suggested raping a bitch to prove he was cohort. Wow. So now he had a choice between going back to his life or making money with made men. Up in the sight, his dreams about cars and ice made him agree. A hardcore nigga is all he ever wanted to be, and so he. What I gather from that is like we're we're burning in the melting pot. New York is considered the melting pot, and we're struggling. We're suffering in the melting pot. You know what I mean? There's no diversity. There's no different way of thinking. We all want to be some someone that we're you know, we're all trying to fulfill right. this tough guy, whatever that we feel we need to fulfill in order to be to belong or to be accepted amongst these these niggas that's doing nothing with their life right. on the block. So we're burning. We're suffering. You know what I mean? We're in hell in the melting pot. I guess is what he's saying by that. No. Nope. They drove around a project slow while it was raining Smoking blunts, drinking and joking for entertainment Until they saw a woman on the street walking alone Three in the morning coming back from work on the way home And so they quietly got out the car and followed her Walking through the projects, the darkness swallowed her They wrapped her shirt around their head and knocked her onto the floor This is it kid, now you got your chance to be raw So Billy yoked her up and grabbed the chick by the hair And dragged her into a lobby that had nobody there She struggled hard but they forced her to go up the stairs they got to the roof and then held it down on the ground Screaming, shut the fuck up and stop moving around The shirt covered her face, but she screamed and clawed So Billy stomped on the bitch until he broke in the jaw Them dirty bastards knew exactly what they were doing They kicked her until they cracked her ribs and she stopped moving Blood leaking through the cloth, she cried silently And then they all proceeded to rape her violently Billy was made to go first, but each of them took a turn Ripping her up and choking her until her throat burned Her broken jaw mumbled for God, but they weren't concerned Dude, this is like brutal, man. I stopped bobbing my head. I'm like, <laughs> like yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm a little concerned. Yeah, I know. I'm like, golly, dude, this is crazy. Let's run that back. I was sitting there like, uh, okay. Yeah. I was into it at first, and I was like, and, and I'm still into it. Don't get me wrong, but I'm more captivated in what was what's actually being said. You're yeah. entranced in the story, so yeah. Let's let's we're gonna bring it back, but that's <laughs> that's crazy, bro. Billy was made to go first, but each of them took a turn, ripping her up and choking her until her throat burned. A broken jaw mumbled for God, but they weren't concerned. Wow. When they were done and she was lying, bloody broken and bruised, one of them niggas pulled out a brand new 22. They told him that she was a witness for what she'd gone through, and if he killed that he was guaranteed a spot in a crew. He thought about it for a minute, she was practically dead, and so he leaned over and put the gun right to her head. Prodigy. Shout out the prodigy. Right before he pulled the trigger and ended a life. He 
thought about the cocaine with the platinum and ice And he felt strong standing alone with his new brothers Cocked the gat to a head and pulled back the shirt cover But what he saw made him start to cringe and stutter Cause he was staring into the eyes of his own mother wow. She looked back at him and cried cause he had forsaken her She cried more painfully and when they were raping her His whole world stopped, he couldn't even contemplate His corruption had successfully changed his fate And he remembered how his mom used to come home late Working hard for nothing, cause now what was he worth? Mm. He turned wow. away from the woman that had once given him birth And crying out to the sky cause he was lonely and scared But only the devil responded cause God wasn't there Woo! That's crazy dude that's crazy. Work it all night for nothing because that's what he's worth. Because that's he, what yeah, he's worth. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Because she worked, worked she worked for to him. raise your ass. For him. You know what I'm saying? And then, wow, this is how you repay it? So obviously it was for nothing. For nothing. Wow, man. Yeah, and he that, said. That's a crazy uh, twist right there, though. Man, he said. That's a crazy twist, man. That gets you like that. That's like subconsciously gets you thinking like, wow, man, I need, I need to be a better person, man. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Not said, that I would ever do something like that, but I mean, damn. And he said and cried out to the sky because he was lonely and scared, but the, but only the devil responded because God, God wasn't, wasn't there. there. Yep. You're dancing with the devil, brother. Yep. What can be more evil and fiendish than what you're doing? Than what you did. You raped your mom, man. Mm -hmm. Unknowingly, but still. Yep. <laughs> Crazy. But only the devil responded because God wasn't there. And right then he knew what it was to be empty and cold. And so he jumped off the roof and died with no soul. They say death takes you to a better place, but I doubt it. After that, they killed his mother and never spoke about it. And listen, because the story that I'm telling is true. Because I was there with Billy Jacobs and I raped his mom too. Oh, wow. And the devil follows me everywhere that I go. In fact, I'm sure he's standing among one of you at my shows. In every street cipher, listening to little thugs flow. Wow, dude. That's crazy, man. Is that a true story, though? Wow, man. That's crazy, dude. Said he. <laughs> wow. That is Isn't it crazy to be like this? That's, yeah, why, that's, that's why it was great crazy, that Ryan hasn't, that hasn't heard this song before. That man. is. Because wow. that's what everyone's reaction is when they, when they hear the, uh, yeah. the twist. Man. So first of all, the fact that his mom, like he raped his mom, Billy the guy raped right. his mom, that's a crazy twist. Yeah. And then the fact that this is a true story because he was he said he was there. And he was one of the people to rape her. Yeah, which is crazy. Wow. Standing right next to you, and you wouldn't know. The devil grows inside the hearts of the selfish and wicked. White, brown, yellow, and black color is not restricted. Mm. You have a self-destructive destiny when you're inflicted. Mm. And wow. you're one of God's children and fell from the top. There's no diversity because we're burning in the melting pot. So when the devil wants to dance with you, you better say never. Because a dance with the devil might, might last, last you forever. forever. Hell yeah. Wow, dude. That's why it's considered one of the greatest songs in, in, in history. Yeah. Yeah, that, that, that's why that song is considered one of the greatest songs in, in history. Wow, man. That's just, that's brutal, <laughs> it's man. It's disturbing, right? Yeah. <laughs> I don't even know how to feel about that. I read, like, read somewhere in the comments, uh, some dude typed, yeah, this is the fuck your day up starter kit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's what he typed in the comments. I yeah, thought that was funny. Man. Shout out Damn. to whoever that, that was. But. Yeah, man. I mean, you know, I, wow. <laughs> I, you know, because everything I was going to say is like, I kind of feel bad. Like, man, that's brilliant. But it's it's, it's almost not brilliant because this is what happened. It, it, if this is a true story, this is what really happened. And he put it in a uh, song kind of context yeah. uh, format. Yeah, man. I, you know, I can say, yeah, that takes skill to do and this and that. But, man, at the same time, it's just... It's horrible if that if that's true. You know what I mean. In in an interview, I believe he said this wasn't true. Oh, okay. He said in an interview. That, that is brilliant. True. That was like wow. No but joking. if it was true, <laughs> yeah, you wouldn't fucking admit that it was true. Exactly. <laughs> so, I, I so that's the thing. I'm like, nah, that's not true. Yeah, because you're going to jail. There yeah. is no there is no uh, what is it called? A statute of limitations on murder. Right. You're going to jail. Yeah. So. You can't you can't say yeah. Or being an accessory to murder because I think it's his man pulled the trigger, whatever the case yeah. may be. So, but the details was kind of. <laughs> There's a lot of details there for that to not to be. That's like that OJ shit. Yeah. Where he was like, if at I, 945, yeah. <laughs> Kim Pill had a, a skit they did. They was like, I killed Tyrone in the front of the grocery. That skit on Kim Pill is hilarious. Check that out. But yeah, dude, great, amazing song. Yeah, it is. It amazing is. song. Very, just the storytelling. You were captivated the entire time. Yep. You were entranced. You couldn't take your mind off of it. It was, it was like polarizing. Yeah. 
it was everything. You know what I mean? So amazing classic song from Immortal Technique. I'm happy we were able to do it. Yeah, it's man. good to see Ryan's reaction yeah. to it. And that's why you guys watch reaction videos, because you want to see this is one of those songs that you want to see someone's real reaction to exactly. when they haven't heard it. Crazy. So, Crazy. Excellent song. Love the video. Love doing that video, man. Um, and that's it, guys. If that's you it. enjoyed the video, please hit that like button. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. This is Las Vegas, George, Ryan. We out. We out.